tough first game of the year against a team coming off the tournament, uh, and you guys both shot well, pretty well in the first half, but you're really locking down in the second. Um, any changes you made or anything uh, going into the second? Or just yeah, we made. Uh, I thought I thought we made one defensive change. I don't, I don't want to talk about it publicly, but uh, we made one one, one uh, counter if we had to. Uh, Cooks was really giving us a lot of issues. Uh, I felt like we frustrated him. He had to score most of his points off the free throw line. Uh, but that was, a, was certainly a focal point. And I thought in the first half, uh, I, I, the way it looked like to me, he had 20, <laughs> you know, because he had got so many fouls, but they weren't at the free throw line when he was grabbing those fouls. But uh, uh, he was certainly a focal point for us. And of course, the, we call them the twins, but the two twins, we felt like we had to contain those guys on their three point shooting. It really worked out great because they came out and <laughs> made a three off the first place. So that halftime speech went really well. But, one of the things we talked to our team about it, uh, our program's always been known as Floorburn U, and uh, we weren't Floorburn U, we were Floorburn Olay in the first half, and we challenged our guys defensively, 30% shooting and 25 points in the second half for a team that played in the NCAA tournament last year and won a conference championship, so we were, we were proud of what we did defensively. I wasn't happy how we finished the game, and I wasn't happy with our turnovers, but uh, uh, with everything that's gone on in our program in the last two weeks, we're going to, we're kind of excited about the win. And, and talk about the, the drive today and the, just how they kept coming back, even though, uh, you know, you had some fouls, you had some turnovers, but you, you really came back every time tonight. Uh, the first time we got it to 11 in the first half, they made, I think, a 7-0 run on us and got it back to four. And actually, they cut it back to, uh, I think he got it to one. I think he got it to one mm -hmm. and then we hit a three to take it back to four. But, I was really upset about how we let the lead go. So when we got when we got to 11 and, and Pat called timeout, that was the whole emphasis in the in the in the huddle. That was the whole emphasis. And we had a little deal, an incident where you know a ball was thrown at one of our players, and it just it just it got our guys going. God, it just it got them going. And uh, I really didn't have to say anything other than just challenge them, and uh, they got fired up. So uh, that really kind of helped us.